All right, now let's take a look at our adult T-Rex and our juvenile T-Rex jaw, specifically focusing in on their teeth. As you can see, in Jane's teeth, they're sharper and they have serrated edges like a knife. Compared to our adult, we are still serrated, but they're much thicker and not as sharp. These teeth were designed for crunching and eating bone, while Jane's was designed for tearing the flesh off of the bone. Isn't that fantastic? Look how different they are. If you were to cut open a T-Rex tooth, the ones that are the adults will be shaped like a D. This is different than the juvenile Tyrannosaurus rex. They had more delicate, laterally compressed teeth. We think this has to do with the fact that juveniles and adults had different diets as they grew up. To avoid direct competition with the adult Tyrannosaurus rex, the apex predator, the juvenile T-Rex utilizes different feeding strategies and a different diet, feeding on smaller prey. We call this niche partitioning. This is where animals are using different parts of the ecosystem while still living together in the same environment. The young Tyrannosaurus were probably more agile predators with more mobility. In comparison to the adults, they used their forearms more, but as they grew, their head grew rapidly and developed into a massive bone crushing weapon with banana sized teeth. The adult didn't use forearms like the young ones and their head became the primary weapon.